<clears throat> All praises to Yahweh, Basha, Yahweh Shah, double honors to Apostle Elders in New York, GMS, and Scientology all around the world is teaching truth. My name is Maya Ka'a Naga, we're at Chicago branch of GMS, and uh, you know, right here we had the three stooges from uh, X Ministries. All right, and you see right here they got X Ministry presents the Exposition Show, episode two. Black Hebrew Israelites. All right. And first, we're not black Hebrew Israelites. All right. We're Israelites or Hebrew Israelites. Okay. Nobody's is, is not the color of the damn pants. It's the, the tight ass pants. Uh, this guy got on with the red shoes. All right. And then the pants of this guy right here. All right. This is too damn tall for the chair. Like a fucking idiot. But, um, you know, we're a, bar, uh, a brown, dark brown skinned people, man. All right. And this is not about a black thing, man. All right. Because you have, you have, uh, uh, is a car so called Mexicans. All right. Uh, gas so called Native Americans. All right. Uh, Natalie, uh, Argentines to Chileans. All right. And, <laughs> you know, these are not so called black people. You know, then you had the uh, confusion of faces, man. All right, so I don't know what you get this black confused way. Somebody look like another nation, but they're Israelites, their paternal lineage go back to a so called Negro or a so called Native American or so called Latino. All right, all right, or not. Where are people that was left in you no know, countries that mix with the other women, but there's you know their child still is like because their paternal bloodlines go back to them. All right. So this isn't about a black thing, man. All right. Nobody's black, like a black tire, like a tire. Nobody's white, like the, this background right here. All right. No such thing as white people. All right. There's only two groups of people, dark brown people and red people. Red people are the Edomites. Edom. All right. Uh, uh, So-called white people. In Asian, where you say uh, Adam, Adam one. All right. This is Hebrew for red. All right, so those only different types of people you have the dark brown people, all right, the resonation, then you have the red people, so called white people. Okay, all right, and, and then you ain't gonna type, you go to Bullet Bar, you ain't gonna type black Israel, you ain't gonna show you, it's gonna say Israel, Israel, Israel. All right, so these are the shit black because now it, it, it uh, well, black gives off. You know, an idea that something bad, negative, anything, and that's what they doing. They purposely doing this shit, you know, to slander us. All right. You know, because, you know, it's when people subconscious when you hear the word black, you know, uh, something evil, you know. All right. Uh, everything we do at AX Ministries, of course. Uh, we want it to be rooted in the word and in God's truth and sound doctrine. So we want to bring uh, answers and different things uh, to, you know, to, the, to our audience uh, with this exposition. So I have some uh, people with me that are a part of this, this venture. Uh, first of all is uh, Jay Bryan. Y'all know him as a rapper. Y'all know him from the album Christian Rap Maybe. Uh, he also, also serves as our youth minister at uh, Adamant Believers Council. How you doing, Jake? I'm doing fine, Pastor. How are you, sir? I'm good. And then we have uh, Carmina Barnett, who is a gospel uh, music media mogul. Um, she uh, is a disc jockey, and, and she knows everybody, and she kind of does her thing on the radio. How you doing, Carmina? I am good. All right. So this is the exposition. This is our uh, second episode. And actually, today we will be dealing with uh, the Black Hebrew Israelites. Uh, I think, I don't think a again, we're Israelites or Hebrew Israelites, all right? Not no damn black Hebrew Israelites, all right? There's no state state, no black Hebrew Israelites, no uh, white Hebrew Israelite, purple Hebrew Israelite, blue Hebrew Israelites, all right? We're Hebrew Israelites or Israelites, all right? A day goes by when I don't get at least 100 inquiries via uh, email or text or whatever, especially from pastors that are concerned about this this movement. Uh, I was going to say new movement, but of course it's not new, but this movement of the black uh, Hebrews uh, whose beliefs are 
a spinoff of the Nation of Islam, uh, Nations of God. All right, so that's a lie right there. A spinoff of the Nation of Islam. He going to say Nation of God. So but see, he put that Nation of Islam because, cause, you know, back in, you know, Jake, <clears throat> you know, back in the 19th, I'll say 19, uh, back, I said like in the 1900s, like from like the, uh, if I'm not mistaken, from the 30s and stuff, you had the Nation of Islam out there, and they talked at the so-called black man, the original people and stuff like that, you know, blah, 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 <clears throat> you know, um, now I don't know how far if he if he taught that we are the children of Israel, but you know, talking about Elijah Muhammad, I don't know if he taught that, but I never heard him say that. Now I heard Farrakhan say it. Farrakhan later on, uh, reversed and said that we're we're Edom and that the so called white people is Jacob. All right, so in Farrakhan, I don't know what the hell he's talking about. All right, <clears throat> well then again, he, he do, you know, he just can't tell the truth as it is because he messed with his money too. You know, but, uh, you know, he just told this guy just out route live, man. All right. You got to do just Google Jews of West Africa and all types of information pop up, man. You know, get booked from Babylon to Timber, too. You know, so, you know, you can find there's no excuse, man. All right. And then you can line up uh, the history of what happened uh, to the Jews in West Africa, how they get there, how they get to West Africa. Also, uh, you read books. Um, uh, the history of America ended by James James A. Dare. All right, and uh, and uh, you know they tell you what the customs that the so-called Native Americans kept, man. The fringes, everything. The, the uh, they kept the, the the Shabbat. All right, they arrest. Okay, uh, uh, they did land Shabbat, land rest. All right. <laughs> uh, the vine and meats of twelve parts. They had a high, high, uh, high priest priesthood, just like the tribe of Levi, man. All right, and they fit the curse of the national Israelites, man. Why the so-called Negroes, um, so-called Negroes were brought over here to America and dropped off here. They took the so-called Native Americans and dropped them off to the other side, man. Because both groups are Israelites, and the curse is fit them going to Deuteronomy, uh, forty-five and forty-six. You know. Gods and Earths, the Rastafarians, y'all have heard me talk about these groups, these people groups in uh, the, the Truth Behind Hip Hop series. Um, basically, it's these, all these groups' beliefs, including some. Uh... All right. <clears throat> so, like I said, the guy said he, he got a lot of inquiries from, uh, you know, all the pastor, Pork Chop, Bishop Bacon. All right. Uh, uh, you know, uh, demonic deacons, all right, uh, wrecking reverence, all right, they, they reckon, uh, 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 wrecking hell among our people, praying on them, you know, all right, so let's see, uh, Amos chapter 5, verse 10, it says, they hate him that rebuketh in the gate, and they abhor him that speak up, right, right, so all these, uh, uh, heathen star when he saw, so-called white man, then you got his millions, all right, these, uh, uh, um, bitch of bacon and, and, and demonic deacons and, and, uh, uh, past the pork chops, all right, so they're mad now because now they have to answer questions that they refuse to answer, or they, they had, they, they gotta ask, answer questions that they can't answer, all right, because those that know, those that do know, you know, they'll quote one scripture and talk all goddamn day doing the church service on Sunday. All right. Don't break no scriptures on anything. You ask them to break down Revelation Sunday. They can't do it, man. All right. <clears throat> or you ask them about the, uh, who are the Israelites. You know, they'll give you a run around. So those that do know and those that know, they can't answer, man. And then, and they go along with this, uh, these traditions, not true, but these traditional lies that God loves everybody. Um. Uh, uh, the one everybody called Jesus, who says your house shy, he 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 died for everybody. Everybody could be saved. God don't hate. You know, all these all these lies have been fed to our people all these years, man. All right. And now they they're angry, man. It says, Well, Ecclesiastes chapter one, verse nine. 
It says, the thing that have been, it is that which shall be, um, and that which is done, which shall be done. And there, there is no through God. So this is nothing new, man, because this happened back in uh, uh, Paul time, man. All right. Yeah, the guy's mad because, you know, uh, Paul, Yahweh, 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 was using Paul's vessel to wake up the Israelites in the Greco Roman colonies, man. All right. We'll go right here. It's at Acts chapter 19. All right, for 24, it said, For a certain man named Demetrius, a silver minister, which made silver trans Diana, brought no small gain onto the craftsmen. All right, so, you know, today, Demetrius, or what? The, you know, Sonetta, the Black Unconscious Movement. All right. You got, um, all right, this, you know, really, you know, but this, this, you know, then you got the, um, Bishop Bacon, the pastor Porchos, the Reckon Reverend, the demonic, demonic um, deacons. All right. So these these guys, man, these these guys back today. All right. So it says, uh, whom he called together with workmen of like occupation, says, sir, like I said, whom he called with workmen of occupation, right? So it was their occupation now to keep Israel blinded to the truth. All right. So the guys back again, he they and said, Sirs, you know, you know that by this craft we have our wealth, right? And that's why they they driving all these uh um all these uh Bentleys, Mercedes, Lexus, um, I believe it goes other called Maserati, Tesla, all this stuff, man. The kids driving this and our people can't pay the damn light bill, man. Or or uh, get buried at the church they went to, you know, because they people to suck up all their money, you know, and they living uh, good, man. But now you have our people, so called Negroes, Latinos, and Americans waking up that the fact that they are Israelites and uh, you know is is hurting their pockets, man. All right, so it says uh, at chapter nineteen verse twenty says, so "Moreover, you see and hear that not alone." And Ephraim, but almost throughout all Asia, this Paul had persuaded and turned away much people, saying that they be no God, which are made with hands. All right. So in this situation today, you know, like I said, you got a so-called ego, Latino, Native Americans, and confusing faces waking up to the fact that it's like they ask me these uh, so-called church lady questions that they can't answer or won't answer, man, because it hurt their pockets. All right. It said, at chapter 19, verse 20, it said, when they heard these sayings, they were full of wrath and cry out, saying, great is Diana Fisher, right? All right. All right. So now they, they piss off, man, that uh, that, the, that the brothers out there on the streets teaching the truth, man. All right. And they, they can't answer any questions or won't answer any questions because they hurt their pockets. All right. <laughs> And also, those that don't know, they hold on to that damn plantation Christianity. All right. And it's really messing with their heads, man. You know, um, you know, the truth is, pl is plaguing them, man. All right. It's plaguing them. All right. Like it's supposed to be, man. You know, plaguing these unrighteous, uh, uh, the, the, the damn plaguing these damn uh, demonic men, man. These damn whorehouses called churches, man. All right. It's, it's, <laughs> you know, they worried now, man. They real concerned, man. They scared, man. Just like they father Esau, man, the devil, you know. So, you know, this this was this is all about, man. But, uh, you know, most I will later on. Uh, people, the brothers at the last show, GMS Chicago last show. All right. And uh, you gonna answer these clowns, man. And um, a lot of brothers from within the GMS camps, individual brothers, brothers might do it together and stuff like that. You know, brothers get together with other brothers, but, you know, we're going to answer these clowns, man. All right. But, uh, shout out.